and welcome to another brand new episode of The Crafting Coach. Thanks for joining me. My name is Megan Rosendahl. I am The Crafting Coach, and this week we are going to make Christmas ornaments out of something that you would never think of. Now that it is officially December, sorry, but anything pre-Thanksgiving is just not Christmas for me yet. We can officially move on to some Christmas crafts. This is one that the kids are really going to like, and a million dollars says you already have the main component right in your home. This week we are going to make these amazing eye-catching ornaments out of toilet paper rolls. So here's what we'll need. A toilet paper roll, Mod Podge or Elmer's glue, and glitter. You'll also need a scissors, a paintbrush, and a pencil. I'm also grabbing my tape measure and a hot glue gun. Flatten out your roll and cut it into equal sections. A 4 inch roll cuts into 16 perfect little pieces. Then just start arranging them in a pattern that you like. I start with seven in the middle, gluing them together as I go. I fold pieces in half to make littler points, securing each one with a dab of glue just to secure it. For faster results, I used my trusty hot glue gun. Seriously, if you don't have one of these bad boys, buy one. You'd use it more than you'd think. When you're done, brush the entire surface with a layer of glue or Mod Podge and roll it around in a plate full of glitter. Really get it in there. When you're done, you've created a beautiful snowflake that will look good on any tree. Tie a bit of ribbon or yarn around it after it dries, and you're good to go. You can paint the rolls before or after you're done, before adding glitter, for a really standout piece. I used one roll to make this piece, so if you stock up for a week or two, you should have enough to make several of these amazing ornaments. No one will know what they're made of. Be sure to stop back next Friday morning at 11 a.m. where I'll have another brand new crafting coach project just for you. We'll tear it apart, we'll break it down, I'll tell you what to do, I'll tell you what not to do, and hopefully we'll have just a little bit of fun along the way. Be sure to follow my crafting coach board on Pinterest. Just a reminder that you can find me under Megan Rosendahl. And also be sure to follow the American News online and on our Facebook page because every single crafting coach video that I've ever done is online waiting for you. On the American News homepage, just hover your mouse over the Features tab and scroll down to the Crafting Coach. You can also follow the Crafting Coach directly on Facebook and you can even tweet me at crafting underscore coach. Thanks again so much for tuning in and we'll see you all next week for another Christmas project. Bye.